sorry for the pause, everyone. You know, it's kind of strange you chose that tea. Golden flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind, actually, now that I think about it. You kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenies! Sort of. You know, I was a pretty hot-headed kid. Once, to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time, he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad, but he was beaming. I had never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me, and now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight, like, uh, Papyrus. But, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the guard. Don't tell him I said that. He's just, well, I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty frickin' tough. It's just that he he's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up being friends with you instead. I could never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into smiling shades. That's part of why. I started teaching him how to cook, you know? So um, maybe he can do something else with his life. Oh, sorry. I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Wait a second. Papyrus, his cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now! And if he's not here to have it, you'll have to have it for him. That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking. Which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine. Foo hoo hoo hoo. Afraid we're gonna be best friends? Just picks up my head. Let's start with the sauce. Launches tomatoes. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now pound them to dust with your fist. How will you pound? Strong or wimpy? You punch the vegetables at full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah, yeah! Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients! Now it's my turn! <laughs> oh, we'll just scrape this into a bowl later. But for now, we have the noodles. Homemade noodles are the best, but I just buy store brand. They're the cheapest. Uh, just put them into the pot. How will you put them in? Fiercely. You throw everything in the pot as hard as you can, including the box. It clanks against the empty bottom. Yeah, I'm into it. All right, now it's the time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is! Ready? Let's do it! Hey, 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 come on, come on. Stir harder! 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 Yeah, let me do it. Just demolishes this. Foo hoo hoo hoo! That's the stuff! Alright, now for the final step. Turn up the heat! Let the stove sop symbolize your passion! Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire! Ready? Don't hold anything back! Turn up the heat. Hotter. Hotter! Dang it! Hotter! Wait, that's too... Wait, what happened? Ah, man. No wonder Papyrus sucks at cooking. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to upload in this. So wait, what's next? Scrapbooking? Friendship bra bracelets? Oh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me. And if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because if we're not friends... It means I can destroy you without regret! I've been defeated. My house is in shambles. I've even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. You're one final rematch. All out on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now come on, hit me with all you've got. Undyne is letting you make the first attack. 
fake attack. You pretend to swing it on dying with all your might. What? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking it full force. You just can't muster any intent to hurt me, huh? <laughs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated your stupid sashering attack. But the way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you're not just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human. It seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight. But knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually... Some mean human will fall down here. And I'll take their soul instead. And that makes sense, right? Foo hoo hoo hoo. Oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the sh out of you. That's what best friends are for, right? Foo hoo hoo hoo. Now let's get the heck out of this flaming house. Oh, that thing is. Well, that was fun, huh? We'll have to hang out again another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang out with Papyrus. So if you need me, drop by Snowden, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give Papyrus a ring, okay? Since we're in the same spot, I'll be able to talk too. Well, see you later, punk. Whoop! All right, I'm gonna see you guys later. I'm gonna pause and get to a save point. Hey guys, I just went down here. Tra la la I am the river man. Or am I the river woman? Doesn't really matter. I left to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Ride in the boat? Yes. Where will we go today? Hotland. And we're off. Hum, hum, hum. Hum, hum, hum. I'm having a little concert. Is it Shiren? Come again sometime, tra la la. Seeing such a strange laboratory in a strange place like this, you're filled with determination. Laboratory entrance. All right, see you guys later.